As soon as tomorrow, the grounded Boeing 737 MAX 9 jets will be back in the air. But the problems for Boeing aren't over. Rebecca Castor has more. Weeks after a panel blew out on a Boeing 737 MAX 9 plane mid-flight, the FAA has given the green light for the grounded jets to return to the skies once airlines complete inspections. I feel like it's completely irresponsible. Um, we found that there's you know, many more airplanes that are having problems. Boeing CEO is in damage control on Capitol Hill this week to reassure lawmakers and customers that his planes are safe to fly. You don't have any words of assurance for customers who are too scared to fly on a Boeing plane? We believe in our airplanes. We feel that safe airplanes, our people do. We have confidence in the safety of our airplanes, and that's what all of this is about. The senior executives, they're completely out of touch with the people that are working in the factories. Alaska and United Airlines, the only U.S. carriers with MAX 9s in their fleet, were forced to cancel thousands of flights. While the planes are returning to service, the FAA is now putting limits on Boeing's mass production of 737 MAX jets. Other airlines are not counting on adding the MAX 7 to their fleets this year, and Congress is weighing legislation to hold the aerospace giant accountable. We don't have a future in aviation unless the American public, people who fly, know that they are safe and they feel comfortable getting in an airplane. The National Transportation Safety Board is still investigating what caused the door panel to blow off and will pay another visit to Boeing's assembly plant in Washington State on Friday. In Washington, Rebecca Castor, Fox News.